What's up, Diva fam, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Obviously, you can tell by the title down below, we are washing our brushes today, or, well, we were supposed to wash our brushes today. I kind of already did it um, before I knew I was going to do film this video for you guys. I know I'd spoken about it in the past about kind of doing like a wash my brushes video, just kind of show you guys how I actually wash them, but... I kind of already washed them the other day and they're air drying right now at the moment, but I still want to talk to you about the process of the products I actually do use to wash my brushes, what I used to use, what I use now, um, all that kind of jazz. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and jump into this video. So you guys know the gist. If you like videos like this, don't this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to go ahead and hit that notification bell down below to miss a video with me, your girl Senior D, and let's just go ahead and get into this. All right, so I kind of have my brushes already air drying over here, but I kind of wanted to walk you guys through um, some of the products that I use, that I used to use, um, or that I do use to wash my brushes. So I'm gonna grab it out really quickly um, and kind of walk you guys over to my sink. So I do have just a regular type of sink. Um, I keep some of my products over here. This is the face wash I'm using right now at the moment. That is the um, double cleansing balm that I use right now at the moment, which is by Joa. And then I've just got like hand lotion and um, some hand wash over here. But the products I like to use actually to wash my brushes with, um, first off, starting off, is one of these guys. So this just says, I don't even know who this is by. It's by the brand uh, BC, which is Beauty Concepts. You can actually find this at Marshalls or at TJ Maxx in the beauty area. This is like amazing because obviously it has the suction cups that are on the bottom. And then based on the different areas, you can kind of use them for like the bigger brushes, smaller brushes, um, if you really want to like get into it. Um, I don't remember if I... I think it says it on the bot or on the top of it. But I can kind of get this to focus. So the top part says says face brush cleanse. Um, that one says eye brushes. This one says eye brush rinse, and then that one says face brush rinse, and then you kind of just scrub in the center. Um, so you kind of use it just how you really want to. You don't have to technically use the way that it says to, but either or, this is really great to have. It suctions straight to the sink, and then you can have your water running. Now, when I first was washing my brushes, I actually used to use this. Um, some girl talked about it on youtube a long time ago this is the pink zot soap um you can get this at walmart i believe and i don't remember exactly why she suggested this it says it's so it's a high quality laundry soap and p and can be confidently used for washing your family's clothes um she uses to do her beauty blender and like other stuff it says the pink laundry soap is a minimum of fatty acid content 66 i used to use this and then now I've kind of steered away from it because I kind of just had to store it like this. Um, I was actually thinking about throwing it away because recently I've gone ahead and just switched to something a little bit better. Obviously, when it comes to your brushes, you want to use something that has antibacterial in it. So it kind of really helps cleanse the brushes and get rid of all the dirt and grime. Um, but also helps with the grease that gets trapped in it from like your face oils and stuff like that. So I've actually recently switched to Dawn to actually clean my brushes with and Dawn's very affordable so we all know that when it comes to washing our brushes that's probably just the better route is just to choose Dawn. Um, I went on this suggestion and I used it for years and then now I'm kind of just like why did I do that? I don't know if it ever really did you know get the bacteria or grossness out of like my brushes. They still were clean but when you use Dawn and you get to use your favorite scent like this one just smells like apples. There's another scent I recently picked up um, by Palm Oil, I think that is. I don't remember if that's that, or Pan Oil, I don't know. It's a brand like, for detergent soap as well for like dishes. I don't think it has antibacterial in it though, but I used it recently to wash my brushes with and my brushes smell like blueberry right now at the moment and I'm not mad at it. But definitely it's probably a better choice just to choose something that has antibacterial in it. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. After I wash my brushes, I pretty much take them over here to like a towel um, and just kind of rub out. I also rinse out the excess water in them first. 
and then they kind of just turn back to their natural form obviously making sure that you shape them as best that you can um, and making sure you wash out as much of the soap as possible it's obviously very important that you don't get it into um, the glue area of um, of the brush so that that doesn't start to detach because that's pretty much what happens when your brushes start to break down and the fibers or the hairs start to come out or also the handle starts to loosen up it's because you've gotten too much water into that handle um and yeah that's pretty much it and then i let them air dry for about a day or so so which is why i always have a backup of brushes and then that's pretty much it when it comes to washing my brushes what i do want to say is since you know, we're talking about brushes. If you guys didn't see as I'm walking around um, in this room, I was trying to hide it from you guys, but there's a giveaway in this video. So again, it is the season to be giving away. So actually there are gonna be two giveaways in this video, uh, in this video or two winners basically. So I will be giving away to you guys your very own brush set um, for the holidays. So the first one is going to be this one right here, which is by Pure um, Pure Cosmetics. This is the Complexion Authority brush set. I unclip it really quickly as I can um, and take the top off. It is a full set of face brushes and eye brushes. So I don't know how many are actually in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Um, 11, I think if you include the like bristled one right there, which is more or less just like for your brows. So there is that, that is the first set. And then the other one I recently just got from my BoxyCharm and this is by the LaRousse brand. Um, the packaging, again, A plus for packaging on these people. Like a good job for that. So this is what it looks like. It looks like kind of like a lipstick component. Um, it does have that matte feeling on it too. So go ahead and take the lid off of that. Now this one doesn't have as many brushes as the other one does. This one only came with one, two, three, four, five brushes, but I do have some extra brushes in my um, drawer that I'm gonna go ahead and stuff into here to kind of make it a little bit more equal um, for the giveaway. But in general, I just wanna give back to you guys. So yeah, that is today's giveaway. Me talking to you guys about how I wash my brushes, um, what products I actually use. This is pretty much a short and simple video, straight to the point. Um, and yeah, so I appreciate you guys watching this video. I don't know what day it is in Vlogmas, but or when this video is going up, if it's going up before some other giveaways. But you guys always know in the comments down below, I will always have my Vlogmas playlist listed for you guys and also any current giveaways that are going on right now at the moment of this video. So again, I appreciate you guys watching this video so, so much. You guys know the gist. If you like videos like this, give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And don't forget to go ahead and hit that notification bell down below so you miss a video with me, your girl, Senior D. And I'll see you in the next one. But also don't forget these giveaways are open for international and U.S. All of the details will be linked um, in the description or will be <laughs> listed in the description box down below for you guys. Again, it's super simple and easy. You just have to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Give this video a thumbs up. I would hope you guys would like to hit that no notification bell so you guys are notified anytime I post any of my videos and then just leaving a comment down below for me to enter you into this giveaway and what your thoughts were over the video. Pretty much short and simple and easy. So again, I appreciate you guys so, so much. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.